Hello guys and welcome back to another play review on the channel. Today I'm reviewing my first Team of the Year women's card ever because obviously it's the news of the game and it is Sam Kerr who I managed to pack. I was so lucky I managed to pack Sam Kerr. Uh, not used a normal card this year um, but look good at the start. I mean it's dropped off pretty quickly and so is the price But this card looks absolutely insane. Is it gonna be and is it gonna be worth the massive price tag? That's what we're gonna find out in today's review So if you do enjoy today's play of you know what to do smash the thumbs up button for me It's greatly appreciated and if you're new around here Please do subscribe to the channel for more play reviews and FIFA related content as well Go and check out the video which I actually managed to pack Sam Kerr and they also in the same video Pat Ribery, who I've already reviewed, so go and check that out as well. Um, absolutely insane. Could not believe my luck. Probably one of the luckiest pack openings ever. Genuinely. Just insane. Uh, but this is all about Sam Kerr today. She's 5'6", high, high work rate, 4-star skills and a 5-star weak foot. And I think she's going for about 1.5 million coins. Uh, maybe a bit less now. 1.3 million. So, a lot of coins on this game. Uh, is she worth it? That's what we're going to find out. So, she can play striker and centre forward. Amazing pace, 93 acceleration, 91 sprint speed. The shooting category is unbelievable, isn't it? Apart from the penalties at 76, they're quite on the low side, to be honest. Um, obviously, never, unfortunately, I've never watched women's football, to be honest, really. Uh, not got involved in it at all. Um, but 76 penalties, surely she had more than that on a team of the year card. Come on. Come on, mm -hmm. Ian. Uh, she has got 98 tap position, 98 finishing, 91 shot power, 91 long shots, 98 volleys, and 76 penalties, as I've already talked about. The passing is pretty ridiculous. 90 vision, 79 crossing, uh, 76 free kicks, 89 short pass, 76 long pass, and 86 curve. The dribbling, however, unbelievable. 96 agility, 87 balance, 95 reactions, 97 ball control, 96 dribbling, and 97 composure there, unbelievable. 99 head and accuracy and 99 jumping. She is five foot six though, so if she's gonna win any headers, I'm not too sure. I mean, she does have uh, the playstyle plus, which we'll get onto in a minute. Stamina 94, strength of 96, and aggression of 77 there. And yeah, the playstyle plus, she's got power header, and she also has a rapid plus, which is a pretty decent one. And then she also has finesse shot playstyle, um, accelerate playstyle, acrobat, and aerial as well so sorry not accelerate <laughs> quick step play style my bad uh, so it looks pretty good is she going to be good that's what we're going to find out in today's review and if you do need coins to be able to buy sam kerr then check out our sponsor u 7 buycom and just go josh97 to get yourself a cheeky six percent off at checkout all the links you need are in the description below without further ado let's get on into the review of team of the year sam kerr so here we go into match number one with kerr and that's a very nice team rivaldo barnes coleman nesta cafu really nice team Hopefully, we can get some goals with Kerr, and hopefully, she's going to be absolutely insane. Uh, let's find out, eh? Look at that run from Kerr. Absolutely beautiful. We make the space, and there's a goal within four minutes of FIFA. She's gone and absolutely ripped the defence. And what a goal. What a finish. Took that really well. Doesn't have finesse shot plus, but that was a really nice finesse shot. I mean, you expect it, don't you, anyway, from someone who's got the finishing stats that Kerr does. Lovely from Kerr, finesse shot. See, someone with finesse shot plus would have done a lot better than that, wouldn't they? Um, so that is a bit of a con, but... Poor, good save by the keeper. Sam Kerr! <laughs> Take a bow! What a goal that is! Overhead kick off the cross. Absolutely beautiful from Sam Kerr. Oh, lovely, lovely quick feet inside the box. So again, great save by the keeper. Is this going to be a rage quit? Yes, it is. First game, two goals for Sam Kerr. Absolutely brilliant as well. That overhead kick, absolutely superb. In fact, let's have a quick look. Let's have another look at that overhead kick from Kerr. That was just unbelievable, wasn't it? I don't know why it does this. I'm not sure if it does it for you every time you check on a highlight. But look at this. Completely open, overhead kick. What a goal. And then this one as well. I mean, that pass from uh, Ribery there, brilliant. Splitting the play. We cut inside. Finesse shot, easy as you like. Absolutely brilliant goals from Sam Kerr there. Let's go on into the next game. So here we go, game number two with Kerr. And um, yeah, he's done a Zola for his uh, icon evolution. 
who looks insane. I was debating doing Zola, to be honest, because it looks like one of the best, but not done it yet. But hopefully Sam Kerr can absolutely rip this guy like she did in the last game. Oh, lovely play. First time volley. I had to do it first time, didn't I? Probably could have took it down and scored, but, you know, we want them wonder goals. Not quite. Fine oh, I was going to say finesse Travella. Decent effort. Oh, lovely cut back. Right into Kerr's path. And a lovely finish. The link up play between Team of the Year, Ribery, and Team of the Year Kerr. They're brilliant. And a lovely finesse shot into that bottom corner. But, I mean, you expect players to score that, don't you? Uh, most players, to be fair. But, yeah, it did go in the back of the net, which is the main point. Fernandez, what is that? Oh my god! Oh, lovely play, lovely play. Can Kerr bring it down? Yes, she can. But it's a great save by the keeper. There we go. We make up for it. Is that the hat trick? I think it might be the hat trick. Oh, first time effort, not a bad strike to be fair. I expect more of these to be going in, to be honest. She is a team of the year. Oh my God, imagine, imagine if that had gone in. Oh, so unlucky. Good effort though, really good effort. Oh, lovely from Kerr. I don't know what that shot was. Why did she took it on her left and just didn't boot it with her right? Some of these shots are weird, I've got to be honest. But, I mean, she has scored, what, two, three in this one? I don't actually know. I think it's two. So, here we go into the final game of the review. So, she's currently on uh, two games, four goals. Really nice performance. This team, pretty decent. Diani is so good on this game. If you haven't used that card, you should use it. Uh, it might be a tough one. But, hopefully, Sam Kerr... I'm hoping she's going to get a hat-trick in this one. She's got two and two. Let's make it a hat-trick. Oh, lovely. Lovely play to get in behind. Left-footed effort. I mean, that angle is really tight, to be fair. Not, not a great angle to be having a shot from, but we did anyway. Oh, beautiful play. I mean, she should be scoring a lot more than... she's. Honest to God, she must have had about 50 chances in this review. And only scored four. I mean, that's four in two games so far. But some of the chances, you know, he expected to be putting them in the back of the net. I know they can't score them all, but I don't know. She, she should be scoring more of these, I think. Again. Why is she scoring these? Is it because she doesn't have finesse shot plus? I don't know, but this, honest to God, with the finishing that she has, that should have been in the back of the net, shouldn't it? Come on. I'm not being silly here, am I? That should have been flying in the back of the net. She's got 98 finishing for crying out loud. There we go. That is what Sam Kerr is going to be good at. And she does finish this one. Finally, we get a goal. I'm not going to lie. My, my defence has fell apart. Alison could save a word document in this game, but we do finally get a Sam Kerr goal in this game and well deserved as well. I mean, we should have took our chances. Uh, she could have had about five or six goals in this game, but it's not to be. Can we pull it back? Let's find out. Oh, there we go. Again. This time a cross goal. Don't know what it is with the cross goal shots in there. She just doesn't seem to put them in the back of the net. So, we got absolutely bad 6-2 there. Honest to God, Alisson couldn't fucking catch a cold. He was so shit. But, you can't win them all, can you, lads? Don't know how we didn't, to be fair. Sam Kerr did not take her chances in this game. Should have scored a lot more. And, you know, we could have been on a level terms or even win this game if she'd have put them in the back of the net. Uh, I want to do. I want to see the match stats in this Um Match facts. 
There you go. We had seven shots to their 11. And we should have scored more. We should have scored more. But this one's been about Sam Kerr. She did get a goal in this one, but didn't take as many chances as I expected to. Let's get on into the player summary of Sam Kerr. So here we are and my overall thoughts and opinions of Sam Kerr. In three games, she scored five goals. And honestly, that could have been double and should have been double. Not sure why. I think there's a couple of reasons why that it wasn't um, like 10 goals. And that is because she doesn't have any playstyle pluses for finesse shot i didn't even realize she had a playstyle for finesse shot to be honest because her finesse shots weren't that good whatsoever didn't feel very good at finesse shots just powering into the back of the net seemed very what she was good at um didn't win a single header which considering she's got 99 heading she also has a power header uh, playstyle plus it's because she's five foot six so not going to win any headers. Doesn't feel very strong, even though the card suggests that that she's going to be strong. And that's because of how small of a player she is. But what she's good at, turning inside-out defenders, absolutely rinsing them, she can do that. The finishing is good. But honestly, I thought she'd get a lot more goals. Uh, it could be my fault. I don't think it is, though. She just wasn't scoring as many as I thought she would. Um, but don't get me wrong, she scores a lot of goals. Uh, another minor con on the card is the high, high work rates. Um, not the best for a striker. You do find that, you know, lingering at the edge of the box when you're in the box, stuff like that. So that is something to be aware of. But all in all, she is a really good card. 1.5 mil. Uh, 1.3 mil, sorry. Not bad at all. I and mean, she is going to drop even more when the full team comes out. So... Go and try it. Go and try it. Let me know what you think. I'm going to rate this Sam Kerr probably about an 8.5 out of 10. Not the best in the world. Expected better. But at the end of the day, she's going to score you goals. And that's what she did for me. So thank you all for watching today's play review. If you have enjoyed it, please smash the thumbs up button. And if you are new around here, please do subscribe to the channel for more play reviews. And I hopefully catch you all in the next one. See you later, guys.